Players who have been eagerly awaiting to get their hands on Texas Chainsaw Massacre have been asking this question, what do we expect from the technical test on the 25th of this month? Well, recently in a blog from Gun Media, they actually broke their silence and told us exactly that. So let's talk about it, as well as you'll see some cheeky new gameplay. What's up, guys? I'm Salt Sleggy. Thanks for tuning in today. First things first, this is not a beta. This is a technical test. Both are completely different from each other, and we'll get onto that a little bit later. The technical test will only take place on PC, so sorry my console brethren but for those that don't know how do you participate it's easy you just wishlist the game on steam and hope to be picked so if you haven't already be sure to wishlist the game on steam that is your only chance of getting a chance to actually play the technical test i'm sure there will be a beta leading up to release so when we do get that announcement i will obviously make a video about it now, will Gun work with content creators? Of course they will. It's all about marketing and getting more eyes on your game. And then the last one is self-explanatory. If you get picked, you obviously receive an email that you've been added to the tech test. Now, next up, we have the specs that are required in order to play this technical test at certain frame rates. And they're a bit extreme, I've got to say. The developer state, Quote, below we have listed the required specs to play the technical test for the Texas Chainsaw Massacre, separated by resolution and expected frame rate. Please keep in mind that these specs are intentionally a bit more strict than what would be present at launch. The final build of the game will have further optimization and that will impact the required specs, allowing a wider variety of machines to run the game well. End quote. So we've got the uh, 2070 RTX for 1080, 30 frames, 3070 for 60, 4K at 30 for a 3090 and then 4K at 60 for 4090 like my specs are lower than all these so even if i get in i'm probably not going to get that great performance now if you're a content creator do you think you'll be under nda no actually you won't this means that all players can stream create and upload content so that means i can stream it during the test is the test free of course the test is free for anyone who receives that email from steam so what's the difference between the tech test and the beta? The tech test differs from the beta and the technical test is more focused on stress testing the game and obviously the servers, allowing our team to adjust server load and make any adjustment prior to launch. So what content will you expect? Maps, characters and metagame. So players can expect PvP matches with other players who've received Steam keys. You will be allowed to access the family house only during the technical test. Players can expect to play as Victim, Leland, Connie, Sonny and Anna. So no Julie. For family players, players will be able to choose from the cook, the hitchhiker and Leatherface. So that's no Sissy and no Johnny. And being that this is a technical test, the places are limited so even if you wish to list the game on steam it doesn't necessarily mean you will actually get in to play the test so fingers crossed for me and fingers crossed for you the test is going to be running for four days so that's thursday friday saturday sunday the build of the tech test is the latest build of texas chainsaw as well but it is not the final version on release day the game will be the finalized version and the purpose of the tech test is to see how the game handles the player base the servers the gameplay the ins and outs of the texas chainsaw massacre this will not only be for players, but also for the developers to see what works and what may possibly need improvement before its release date on August 18th of this year. First of all, I want to thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please smash a like because it really helps out the channel and get fresh eyes on the channel as we head towards that 1000 subscriber milestone. I hope it was informative too. You can find all this information on their website, so go check it out. And if you want to stay up to date with everything Texas Chainsaw, then subscribe for more upcoming games. You'll find other games on my channel if you want to check those out. You'll find social links down below if you want to support me in that space. Hit that notification bell. And as always, have a wonderful day. I'll see you next time.